I'm the Dean of Engineering at the University of Alabama at Birmingham. And what I love uh, about my job here is on the research side, I get to arrange collaborations between our faculty and people all over campus, medicine, public health, um, doing lots of interesting work to improve the world. A big part of my job is long range planning for the school. On the research side, that includes both setting up collaborations and new initiatives that involve our current faculty, but also thinking about what areas we might want to hire new faculty as we plan and grow for the future. I chose Dimensions because we were looking for information that could help us make decisions about future areas of hiring, future areas of research growth. Uh, and I really felt that Dimensions was a product that would give us data. I'm an engineer, I like making my decisions based on data, that would give us data to help inform those strategic decisions that we needed to make. When you're thinking about future areas of research growth from a school point of view, you also want to grow in areas where there are going to be good funding opportunities. And that was the unique piece that we could find through Dimensions that we couldn't get through other sources. Another way that we've been using Dimensions sounds quite simple, um, but it's in tracking our own productivity in terms of publications and grants. Um, it, it would seem that that's, that's easy to find out. You just ask all your faculty, but actually um, finding that information from everyone and making sure that you've captured everything is, is not as easy as you think when you sit down to do it. And so Dimensions has been a great tool for us um, because we can create groups that we define. And so, for example, we can create a group that's all of our faculty and then immediately update the searches to find out what publications have come from our faculty this year, what new grant awards have come from our faculty this year. To me, the most important thing about Dimensions is it gives you the same type of searching power that we're familiar with as academics when we search publication databases, look for particular publications or particular authors. It extends that power to funding as well as publications. And that's invaluable for, um, for making strategic decisions, for thinking about areas that you might want to go into, for reporting, for making comparisons to peer groups. Uh, and so for all of those reasons, uh, we've really found Dimensions to be invaluable. You can look and see um, how many publications have been funded by a particular funding source and being able to drill down like that turned out to be very helpful for us in thinking about strategic planning, even within our own university, just understanding where were some pockets of high activity in other schools that we might not know about that could be good opportunities for collaboration for us. Comprehensive, easy to use, and great for a deeper analysis.